So here we are. I'm doing yet another test video. This time with a different tool. So as you can see, I've, I'm in the process of uploading my test video. Oh shoot, it's out of focus on my screen. Um, that's the gaming one, which isn't really ASMR, but um, depending on how the how it goes, I um, I will be adding a, a decent quality voiceover, and I will stay more focused. Uh, this is all very kind of off the top of my head. I'm just killing time. It's it's New Year's Eve, and I really don't like going out. I didn't have plans this year, and I didn't want any. Um, just because it's been a, an emotional roller coaster every year. Um, so many things have happened to so many people and celebrities and me and folks I know. Um, good things, lots and lots of good things and lots and lots of bad things. And so overall, it's a good year, but oh, I don't know. I'm staying home. <laughs> anyway, so. Uh, while that other video is uploading, I'm using the latest version of YouTube Capture to record this one. Just to kind of see. Hmm. I'm a little messy here. I've been spending the whole day. Oh, this thing right here. Oh my goodness, it is so soft. It is so soft. And it has um, like a bean bag in it scented with lavender and you put it in the microwave and it gets warm and then you drape it over you and it warms your neck muscles and oh ah. and sometimes um my mid spine has been really bothering me as well because I've got um an issue in my T spine. And uh so when both my T spine and cervical spine oh golly are are um being a pill I can stick that in the microwave, and it's long, so I can stretch it out and then lay on it. And I've done that a few times since Christmas, and I got it. Thank you, brother. Woohoo! Love you, fam. And it smells wonderful. I love the scent of lavender. And then the fur that, the encasing, the fur encasing, it's fake fur, of course. It's buttery soft. Oh, so luxurious. Um... I had a nice Christmas. I hope you did too. <laughs> you can probably hear my daughter and her little friend. Um, they're watching something goofy and just eating popcorn and having a blast. I wanted her to be able to have, I don't know, something to do on New Year's Eve. Kids don't usually get to do anything. And usually I'm super boring. But now that we're in this house and we're with family, it just seems... You know, I'm happy for her. her friend's going to spend the night and all the nice little relaxed breakfast, probably toaster waffles or something. I am, I no longer have a waffle iron. I need to replace one. Can you guys recommend a really high quality, affordable waffle iron? Um, I like Belgian waffles. I have a wonderful Belgian waffle recipe, but it doesn't have to be a Belgian waffle iron. Um... I can, I can change the recipe and just make straight up waffles or pancake mix or whatever, you know. I don't know, just if you think of anything. Anyhow. Um, gosh, class for sure, I thought I hate that. But that's, that's because I'm, I'm not planning these videos. I'm doing things very stream of consciousness. I'm still trying to figure it all out and how I want to proceed. So I know I'm not posting with any regularity yet. And I'm experimenting with different, just different things. Um, and at some point, someone's going to really appreciate something that I do here. So there you go. Um, whoever you are and wherever you are on this December 31st, 2016, I hope that you're closing out the year with a warm and hopeful heart. I hope you do not lack for a good
basic comforts of life. I hope you do not lack for love and laughter. I wish you many, many happinesses for 2017 and the years beyond. <clears throat> I'm actually becoming kind of curious to know how the background noise is going to affect the sound quality on this. So now I'm going to have a second bass line because of course I'm using my iPhone. Um, <laughs> bless you, um, big brother who put me on this home plan because I, I could never have any an iPhone, a smartphone, you know, much less an iPhone, and it just, it's really easy to use and works like a dream, and, um, I don't use a lot of data because I'm always home, <laughs> so, but, <laughs> but it's got these really wonderful cameras, and I'm so excited, I'm, I'm trying to experiment with that more, too, I, I need to flex my creative muscles, but I'm really limited as far as the production side goes. So if it takes, if, if the if the finished product to get a high quality finished product is going to take a lot of, you know, editing, pouring over iMovie and GarageBand, and that you know, or it'll <laughs> call it a laptop. It's just a MacBook Air, you know, just a little. There's no drive or anything on the side. It's just USB ports, right? Um, so it doesn't run very fast or anything, and I can't be hunched over a screen for hours, you know, working with files. I did that for a really long time as a graphic designer, and it messed up my neck so bad. So, you know, I still have the urge, and I, I keep hoping that... You know, I can do, I can fall into some kind of a process, some kind of a workflow that'll just be smooth for me, personally. And so that's what you're seeing as far as what I've been uploading thus far. And I appreciate those of you who are taking the time to watch my videos. Um... <clears throat> So this is about eight minutes now. I think that's a pretty solid baseline because um, I need to also be testing upload speed and I don't want to be, for ASMR videos, I don't want to be doing super, super short videos. Um, I think eight minutes is, in my opinion, about as short as you can really get away with and give any kind of a positive ASMR experience unless you're talking about you know, downloaders and putting the file on your um, computer and hitting repeat or, you know what I mean? It's like, I need a more uh, length. That's why you're seeing from me longer content right off the bat, but it's not always in my best interest to do that because I'm having issues with uploading just the length of the files. So, it's got a different...